Hi guys, it's Ali. Welcome to another Thrifty Tingles, where I visit a local thrift store in search of tingly items to share with you. If you've never seen Thrifty Tingles, there are three basic rules that I have to follow. Rule number one, I cannot spend over five Rule number two, the item or items that I purchase have to be not only tingle-worthy, but also useful to me in my own life. And rule number three, each time I visit the thrift store, I have to bring something of mine to donate. Something that I'm no longer using, but could be of benefit to somebody else. So on this trip to the thrift store, I donated a couple old purses of mine that I don't use anymore. Um, but they're still in very good shape. I'm just... I'm over them. <laughs> and I found two different items. I'll show them to you. The first one I found... I might need your help identifying what this is, but I found this big bag of these weird little wooden uh, block kind of things that I have not ever seen before. They're the kind of thing that my son really likes to play with. So I grabbed these for him. And I'll show them to you in more detail and uh, up close in a minute. In the other item I found, This is some, uh, like, dried grass. Um, it's a grass skirt, actually, like a hula skirt. Um, and I got this for my cat, which I will explain in further detail uh, when I show this one to you. The grass skirt was $2.99, so I was right at my $5 budget. Okay, so I'm going to open up this bag and play with these blocks a little bit, make some sound. them to you closer up so maybe you can help me figure out what they are. So to me, they kind of look like little um, boat. The grass skirt bag is making noises. Yeah, they kind of the bottom of them makes them look like they're little boats almost, but they're not quite. <laughs> Yeah, 
they don't they're all this shape so they don't really like fit together that I can see or maybe they do they kind of look like they might be pieces to some little puzzle or something like a puzzle game not sure but my little boy really likes little wooden blocks and kind of really random objects uh, that you wouldn't expect Super entertaining toys for a kid, but that's who he is. The other day we were at Hobby Lobby. And I was buying something for a video. And he saw the um, whole autumn display section of the store. It had lots of um, fake pumpkins of all different sizes. And he was obsessed with them. And he was begging and begging for me to get him one. So I figured why not and I got him a small plastic pumpkin. And he loves that thing. He still carries it around anything, doesn't have any function other than being sort of decorative, but for some reason it's like one of his favorite toys. <laughs> it's not even a toy. But it is to him, I guess. Anyway, so this looked like the kind of thing that he would like. I really can't figure out what these are supposed to do. Maybe something like that. I don't know. <laughs> but my son will like them and I thought they would make really great little sounds for the video. I like the little sounds of wood tapping together like this. Um, Dimitri Massage ASMR. We'll do little little wooden block tapping sounds in his videos sometimes. And he does it so lightly. You can barely hear.
I am a big fan of Laura of I don't totally know how to pronounce the name of her channel, but I think it's Laura Lemure. put on Laura's most recent video. It's a multi-layered sounds video with some really nice uh, hand movements. Do you want the video back? And he said, please. And so I picked the phone back up and he was perfectly happy after that. And he just kept watching it. And I thought it was really, really sweet. And I thought, Laura might like to know. And her video really appealed to my, my son, who may or may not experience ASMR. Who knows? So this little bag.
weird block things, but I can't hold six of them at a time. Move on now to a second thrifty tingles item. So, um, when I originally saw this at the thrift store, I did not <laughs> realize that it was a, a hula skirt, like a grass skirt, until after I got it home and opened it up, right before shooting this video. And it doesn't really matter. As I mentioned, this is a present for my kitty cat. A long, long, long time ago, I made a Thrifty Tingles video. It was Thrifty Thursday at the time. I believe it was my first one. I found a package of raffia, which is just kind of like a papery, uh, like a grassy papery thing that people use for um, crafts and gift wrapping. And I used some of that in some gift wrapping and whatnot, but a portion of it also unexpectedly a cat toy. Um, my cat was uh, bad about chewing wires that were on the ground at the time and then he got a hold of some of the raffia that I had and that completely ended up kind of destroying all of the all of that raffia that he got. And so I got this for him when I saw it at the thrift store this time because it's really really similar. And I know that this will please him. He likes to play with it. He never ate any of it. He doesn't ingest it. He just kind of um, chews it. 
chews it the way that cats will sometimes chew on grass and stuff like that. I think they're cleaning their teeth, possibly. The reason, particular reason that I got this for my cat this week, is that I'm about to go out of town. I'm going on a big trip. And if you want to hear more about uh, the trip I'm going on, I'll be talking about it in a vlog that's coming up soon and giving you a few more details. I'm going to be leaving soon on the trip, and my poor cat has to stay home. And he'll have um, family members coming in every day to come check on him and feed him and give him love and play with him a little bit. And he'll be well cared for, but unfortunately he's very, very attached. Me and my boyfriend, especially my boyfriend. I think it's really um, anxious, I think, and upset when we're away. The last time we took a really long trip, he was like beside himself the day we got home, and for like a week after that, he was really, really clingy. Even more than usual. Emotionally needy. So I got this with him in mind because I know he's gonna have a tough time while we're away. We're gonna be gone for quite a while, nearly two. It was a big hula skirt. Which doesn't really make that much of a difference. Well. He's going to chew on it. I believe this is, I think it's actual grass that's just dried. Looks like grass. So that'll be even better. I think he'll like it even more than that.
really weird cat. He drives me crazy a lot of the time. But I miss him. I'm away from him for a long time. It makes me sad to know that he's stressed out and confused.
Okay, guys. Well, I hope. That you've enjoyed this thrifty tingles and found it. Seeing you again very soon. Good night. that this action figure is wearing. He really looks absolutely nothing.